Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A man is reading a newspaper in a cafe. B. People are waiting for a bus at a bus stop. C. A man is writing in a notebook while sitting on a bench. D. A group of people is playing soccer in a park. The correct answer is C. A man is writing in a notebook while sitting on a bench. Number 2. A. People are shopping for groceries. B. A woman is filling out paperwork at a train station. C. A man is speaking to a cashier. D. A group of students is attending a lecture. The correct answer is B. A woman is filling out paperwork at a train station. Number 3. A. Several workers are repairing a road. B. People are standing in a train station using electronic devices. C. A group of tourists is walking through a shopping mall. D. Two people are cooking in a kitchen. The correct answer is B. People are standing in a train station. Number 4. A. A woman is giving a presentation about space. B. Students are studying in a library. C. A group of friends is watching a movie in a theater. D. People are working out in a gym. The correct answer is A. A woman is giving a presentation about space. Number 5. A. Several people are having a conversation in a park. B. Two people are walking along a beach. C. A man is working on a laptop in a cafe. D. A woman is speaking to a group in an office. The correct answer is C. A man is working on a laptop in a cafe. Number 6. A. A woman is working on her computer in a meeting room. B. A group of tourists is visiting a historical site. C. Workers are fixing equipment in a factory. D. Some people are having a meeting outdoors. The correct answer is A. A woman is working on her computer in a meeting room. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Why is the office closed early today? A. There is a company event. B. I came in late. C. We'll open again tomorrow. The correct answer is A. There is a company event. Number 2. Is the office open on weekends? A. Yes, from 9 to 5. B. Only on Saturdays. C. No, it's closed. The correct answer is A. Yes, from 9 to 5. Number 3. How can I get to the conference room? A. Take the elevator to the third floor. B. It starts at 10 a.m. C. No, I haven't attended the conference. The correct answer is A. Take the elevator to the third floor. Number 4. Why were you late for the meeting? A. I'm always on time. B. I had a doctor's appointment. C. The meeting was cancelled. The correct answer is B. I had a doctor's appointment. Number 5. Who will lead the team in the project? A. I prefer the blue one. B. Yes, it's possible to do that. C. Sandra will.
The correct answer is C. Sandra will. Number 6. Why are you late? A. I was stuck in traffic. B. Yes, we met yesterday. C. No, I don't know him. The correct answer is A. I was stuck in traffic. Number 7. Do you prefer tea or coffee? A. I prefer tea. B. Yes, at 3 p.m. C. It's my favorite drink. The correct answer is A. I prefer tea. Number 8. How do I get to the conference room? A. You need to follow the signs. B. The conference is tomorrow. C. I'm attending the meeting too. The correct answer is A. You need to follow the signs. Number 9. Will you be attending the conference next week? A. The manual is on your desk. B. Yes, I've already registered. C. I need to finish my report. The correct answer is B. Yes, I've already registered. Number 10. Who is in charge of the project? A. It's James from the IT department. B. I think we should start it now. C. At the end of this week. The correct answer is A. It's James from the IT department. Number 11. Would you like some coffee? A. Yes, I'd appreciate it. B. I'll have some later. C. No, thanks. The correct answer is C. No, thanks. Number 12. Have they fixed the air conditioning? A. Last month. B. In the cafeteria. C. Yes, it was repaired this morning. The correct answer is C. Yes, it was repaired this morning. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening. Conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Can you send me the final draft of the report by end of day? Sure. I'll have it ready and emailed to you by 5 p.m. Great, thanks. Do you need anything else? No, that's all for now. When will the final draft of the report be sent? A. By noon. B. By 5 p.m. C. In the morning. The correct answer is B. By 5 p.m. Number 2. I would like to reschedule our lunch meeting. Sure. When would you like to meet instead? How about tomorrow at noon? That sounds good to me. I'll see you then. When will the rescheduled meeting take place? A. Today at noon. B. Next week. C. Tomorrow at noon. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow at noon. Number 3. Have you finished the inventory count? I'm almost done. Just a few more items to check. We need to submit the report by this afternoon. I'll make sure it's completed and submitted by then. When does the report need to be submitted? A. By this morning. B. By this afternoon. C. By tomorrow. The correct answer is B. By this afternoon. Number 4. Are you still available for lunch today? Yes, where should we go? How about that new Italian place downtown? Sounds good. See you at 12.30. What time will they meet for lunch? A. At 12.30. B. At 1 o'clock. C. At 12 o'clock. The correct answer is A. At 12.30. Number 5. Could you cover for me at the reception desk during my break? No problem. How long will you be? Just 20 minutes. All right. See you then. How long is the woman's break? A. 15 minutes. B. 20 minutes. C. 30 minutes.
The correct answer is B. 20 minutes. Number 6. Have you seen the email about the team building event next Friday? Yes, I saw it this morning. Are we supposed to bring anything? Just comfortable clothes and a good attitude. Sounds good. What do they need to bring? A. Comfortable clothes. B. Drinks. C. Food. The correct answer is A. Comfortable clothes. Number 7. I'm planning to take a day off next Friday. Do you have any specific plans? Yes, I'm going to visit my family. That sounds nice. Don't forget to submit your leave request form. What does the man need to remember? A. To finalize a report. B. To book travel tickets. C. To submit a leave request form. The correct answer is C. To submit a leave request form. Number 8. Are you traveling for the conference next month? Yes, I have my tickets and hotel booked. Great, I'll see you there. Looking forward to it. What does the woman have booked? A. A flight ticket and hotel. B. A taxi service. C. A restaurant reservation. The correct answer is A. A flight ticket and hotel. Number 9. Did you already review the client presentation? Yes, I did last night. Great. Do you have any feedback? Just a few minor changes. I'll send them to you. What did the man do last night? A. Sent feedback. B. Reviewed the client presentation. C. Went to a meeting. The correct answer is B. Reviewed the client presentation. Number 10. Did you finish the client presentation slides? Yes, I just added the final touches. Great. Can you send them to me? Sure, I'll email them right now. What did the woman finish? A. A report. B. Meeting minutes. C. A presentation. The correct answer is C. A presentation. Number 11. Have you received the new marketing strategy document? Yes, I have. I'll go over it tonight. Let's discuss it tomorrow afternoon then. Sounds good. I'll be ready. When will they discuss the marketing strategy document? A. Tomorrow afternoon. B. Tomorrow morning. C. This afternoon. The correct answer is A. Tomorrow afternoon. Number 12. I'm struggling with the presentation slides for Client X. Can you take a look? Sure, send them over and I'll review them by noon. Thanks. Not a problem. Happy to help. When will the man review the slides? A. Immediately. B. By the end of the day. C. By noon. The correct answer is C. By noon. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Parents and students are invited to our school's open house next Tuesday evening. Explore the campus, meet the faculty, and learn about our programs. The event starts at 6 p.m. in the auditorium with a welcome speech by the principal. We hope to see you there. When does the open house event start? A. 5 p.m. B. 7 p.m. C. 6 p.m. The correct answer is C. 6 p.m. Number 2. Attention shoppers. Our store is running a special promotion this weekend. Purchase any two items and get the third one at half price. Be sure to take advantage of this limited time offer to make the most of your shopping experience. What is the promotional offer mentioned? A. Buy three get one free. B. Buy one get one free. C. Buy two, get the third at half price. The correct answer is C. Buy two, get the third at half price. Number three. Good morning. Thank you for flying with us today. We ask that you please pay attention to the safety demonstration. Your seatbelt should be fastened whenever the seatbelt sign is on. 
In case of an emergency, oxygen masks will drop from the overhead compartment. When should passengers fasten their seatbelt? A. When landing. B. During takeoff. C. Whenever the seatbelt sign is on. The correct answer is A. Whenever the seatbelt sign is on. Number 4. Join us for the annual food festival this weekend at Riverside Park. The festival features gourmet foods, cooking demonstrations by famous chefs, and family-friendly activities. Don't miss the opening ceremony at 11 a.m. on Saturday. When is the opening ceremony of the food festival? A. 11 a.m. on Sunday. B. 11 a.m. on Saturday. C. 10 a.m. on Saturday. The correct answer is C. 11 a.m. on Saturday. Number 5. Join us tomorrow at the downtown plaza for a spectacular farmer's market. Enjoy fresh produce, artisanal breads, and handcrafted goods from local vendors. The market opens at 9 a.m. and runs until 2 p.m. Don't miss our live music performances starting at 11 a.m. Come support the community and enjoy a wonderful day out. What time do the live music performances start? A. 2 p.m. B. 9 a.m. C. 11 a.m. The correct answer is A. 11 a.m. Number 6. Our online store is having a clearance sale with up to 50% off selected items. Visit our website and take advantage of these limited time offers. Free shipping is available for orders over $50. How much can you save in the clearance sale? A. Up to 30%. B. Up to 70%. C. Up to 50%. The correct answer is A. Up to 50%. Number 7. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for attending our annual charity gala. Tonight, all the proceeds will go to children's education. We have various activities lined up to make your evening enjoyable. Please check the programme schedule at your table. What is the purpose of the event this evening? A. To celebrate national holidays. B. To fund children's education. C. To introduce new board members. The correct answer is A. To fund children's education. Number 8. Attention all passengers. Due to inclement weather, flight 542 to New York has been delayed by two hours. Please check the airport monitors for updated departure times. We apologize for any inconvenience caused and thank you for your patience. Why has flight 542 been delayed? A. The crew is late. B. Technical issues with the plane. C. Inclement weather. The correct answer is A. Inclement weather. Number 9. The annual cooking competition will be held at Central Plaza this Sunday. Chefs from around the region will compete in various categories, including appetizers, main courses, and desserts. Come and enjoy delicious food and entertainment. Where will the cooking competition be held? A. City Park. B. Grand Hotel. C. Central Plaza. The correct answer is B. Central Plaza. Number 10. Ladies and gentlemen, please fasten your seat belts as we are about to land in New York City. The flight attendants will be coming around to collect any remaining trash. Please make sure your seat and tray table are in their upright positions. What are the flight attendants doing? A. Fastening seat belts. B. Adjusting seats. C. Collecting trash. The correct answer is B. Collecting trash. Number 11. We are excited to announce the grand opening of our new organic food store this Friday at 10 a.m. Enjoy special discounts and free samples on opening day. Join us in celebrating healthier lifestyles. What can customers expect on the opening day? 
A. Special discounts and free samples. B. Regular prices. C. Free membership. The correct answer is B. Special discounts and free samples. Number 12. Join us at the annual health fair this Saturday at Community Hall. There will be free health screenings, fitness classes and nutritional workshops. This is a great opportunity to learn more about maintaining a healthy lifestyle. Don't miss out on the fun and informative activities. What is the purpose of the event? A. To teach about a healthy lifestyle. B. To enjoy fun activities. C. To provide health screenings. The correct answer is B. To teach about a healthy lifestyle. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin! Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one. They haven't completed the project. A. Still. B. Yet. C. Any more. D. Already. The correct answer is B. Yet. Number two. She's responsible. Managing the new project. A. About. B. Two. C. With. D. Four. The correct answer is D. 4. Number 3. We should. More details before making a decision. A. Gathers. B. To gather. C. Gathering. D. Gather. The correct answer is D. Gather. Number 4. There is no rain tomorrow. We will hold the event. A. Although. B. If. C. Unless. D. Because. The correct answer is. C. Unless. Number 5. The new software. By the IT team yesterday. A. Is installed. B. Installed. C. Was installing. D. Was installed. The correct answer is D. Was installed. Number 6. The meeting was postponed. The weather. A. Because. B. Because of. C. In spite of. D. Despite. The correct answer is B. Because of. Number 7. She. The team before the project begins next week. A. Has joined. B. Will have joined. C. Is joining. D. Joins. The correct answer is. B. Will have joined. Number 8. They were. Tired to continue working late into the night. A. So. B. Very. C. More. D. Two. The correct answer is D. 2. Number 9. They. The new system when the power went out. A. Are testing. B. Tested. C. Were testing. D. Have tested. The correct answer is C. Were testing. Number 10. The manager insisted. The importance of teamwork. A. To. B. On. C. With. D. About. The correct answer is. B. On. Number 11. The employee has worked here. 20 to 10. A. 
from b in c since d four. The correct answer is C. Since. Number 12. The results were disappointing than expected. A. 2. B. More. C. As. D. Most. The correct answer is B. More. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Our office will be closed on Wednesday in of Independence Day. We will resume normal business hours on Thursday. A. Observing. B. Observance. C. Observe. D. Observation. The correct answer is B. Observance. Number 2. Good morning, everyone. As per our last meeting, the quarterly results report needs to be None. Please submit your sections by the end of the week. Best management. A. Finalizing. B. Finalize. C. Finalized. D. Finalization. The correct answer is C. Finalized. Number three, we have received several about the noise level in the office. Please be considerate of your colleagues. A. Complaints. B. Complain. C. Complaining. D. Complaint. The correct answer is A. Complaints. Number four, attention team. The security training session will be on Tuesday at 10 a.m. in the main hall, please mark your calendars. Best, security office. A, conducting. B, conducts. C, conducted. D, conduct. The correct answer is. C, conducted. Number five. Two, all employees subject. Annual leave policy update. The annual leave policy has been updated. Please review the attached document for details. A. Accordance. B. Accordingly. C. Accordion. D. According. The correct answer is B. Accordingly. Number 6. This memo is to inform all employees that the office will be closed. Ooh. A. At Friday. B. On Friday. C. In Friday. D. By Friday. The correct answer is B. On Friday. And finally, Part 7 Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear residents, Please be advised that the water supply will be temporarily shut off for maintenance on October 3rd from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. We apologize for this inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. Regards, Building Management. Why will the water supply be shut off? A. To replace old pipes. B. To install a new water meter. C. For scheduled maintenance. The correct answer is C. For scheduled maintenance. Number 2. Dear valued customers, we are happy to inform you that our customer support hours are being extended to 24 7. This change is in response to your feedback requesting more accessible support. We appreciate your business and continued trust. Warm regards, Customer Service Team. What change is being announced? A. Extension of customer support hours to 24-7. B. Reduced service charges. C. New product launch. The correct answer is A. Extension of customer support hours to 24-7. Number 3. Hello, staff. As part of our sustainability initiatives, 
we are installing new recycling bins in all office areas. Please make sure to use these bins appropriately to help reduce waste. Together, we can make a difference. Cheers! Office Management Team What is being installed in all office areas? A. New recycling bins B. New coffee machines C. New printers The correct answer is A. New recycling bins Number 4. This is a reminder that the office will be closed for maintenance from June 10th to June 12th. Please ensure that all essential work is completed before these dates. We apologize for any inconvenience. Thank you for your cooperation. Why will the office be closed? A. For a meeting. B. For a holiday. C. For maintenance. The correct answer is C. For renovation. Number 5. Reminder. Company meeting on Friday at 3 p.m. in Conference Room B. Attendance is mandatory unless explicitly excused by a supervisor. Topics include quarterly performance, upcoming projects, and employee feedback. Please prepare any questions or comments you may have. What is the main purpose of this announcement? A. To cancel a meeting. B. To applaud employee performance. C. To remind employees about a company meeting. The correct answer is C. To remind employees about a company meeting. Number 6. As part of our ongoing commitment to sustainability, we are launching a new recycling program company wide. Starting next week, recycling bins will be available in all common areas, and employees are encouraged to recycle paper, plastic, and aluminum waste. What is the company implementing? A. A new dress code policy. B. A new recycling program. C. An extended work hour policy. The correct answer is B. A new recycling program. Number 7. Dear shareholders, we are pleased to report that our annual revenue has exceeded projections by 15%. This success is attributed to our new product launches and expanded market reach. We will continue to drive innovation and growth in the coming year. Thank you for your continued support. Sincerely, the Board of Directors. What is the key achievement mentioned in the report? A. The company held a large event. B. The annual revenue exceeded projections. C. A new CEO has been appointed. The correct answer is B. The annual revenue exceeded projections. Number 8. Attention staff. Due to unforeseen circumstances, the staff meeting scheduled for this Wednesday has been postponed to Friday at 10 a.m. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. Please mark your calendars accordingly. When has the staff meeting been rescheduled to? A. Wednesday at 2 p.m. B. Thursday at 9 a.m. C. Friday at 10 a.m. The correct answer is C. Friday at 10 a.m. Number 9. To whom it may concern, you are cordially invited to attend the grand opening of our new corporate office next Friday at 2 p.m. We would be honored to have you join us for a tour and refreshments. Please RSVP by this Wednesday. Best regards, the administrative team. What is the purpose of this invitation? A. To invite to an office opening. B. To announce a meeting. C. To offer a job interview. The correct answer is A. To invite to an office opening. Number 10. To all employees, starting next month, the company will implement a new flexible working hours policy. This change aims to provide better work-life balance and improve productivity. More details will be shared in the upcoming staff meeting. What is the reason for implementing the new policy? A. To extend working hours. B. To provide better work-life balance. C. To reduce employee wages.
The correct answer is B. To increase office space. Number 11. Join us for our next webinar on effective project management strategies. Learn tips and techniques from industry experts that you can apply to achieve better project outcomes. Register online to secure your spot. What is the main idea of this announcement? A. Promotion of a project management webinar. B. Results of a recent survey. C. Introduction to new software tools. The correct answer is A. Promotion of a project management webinar. Number 12. Notice. The water supply will be temporarily interrupted in the entire building on Thursday, July 12th, from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m., due to essential maintenance work. We advise all residents to store sufficient water in advance. We regret any inconvenience this may cause. Why will the water supply be interrupted? A. For essential maintenance work. B. To install new pipes. C. Due to a water shortage. The correct answer is A. For essential maintenance work. Number 13. We are excited to announce our new corporate partnership with Green Solutions. This partnership allows us to offer sustainable solutions to our clients. Together, we aim to promote environmental responsibility. What is the main idea of this announcement? A. A new corporate partnership with Green Solutions. B. An upcoming event. C. A new product release. The correct answer is A. A new corporate partnership with Green Solutions. Number 14. Attention shoppers. We are pleased to introduce our new loyalty program. Earn points with every purchase and redeem them for exclusive discounts and offers. Sign up is free and takes just a few minutes. Don't miss out on great savings. What is being introduced in this announcement? A. A new store location. B. A price increase. C. A new loyalty program. The correct answer is C. A new loyalty program. Number 15. Special offer. For this week only, purchase any two items from our clothing line and receive a third item of equal or lesser value for free. Visit our store or shop online at dubitexample.com. Don't miss out on this fantastic deal. Regards, sales team. What is being advertised? A. A buy two, get one free offer. B. A clearance sale. C. A buy one, get one free offer. The correct answer is A. A buy two, get one free offer. Number 16. Attention all staff members. The annual company retreat will take place from August 20th to August 22nd at Laurel Pines Resort. This event aims to foster team building and relaxation among employees. All participants must complete the online registration form by July 25th. We look forward to a productive and enjoyable retreat. What is the purpose of the retreat? A. To conduct a training session. B. To foster team building. C. To launch a new product. The correct answer is B. To foster team building. Number 17. Attention all employees. The next quarterly meeting will be held on Thursday, December 10th at 10 Honey M in the main conference hall. Key topics will include company performance, upcoming projects, and employee recognitions. Please be punctual. Regards, operations team. When is the next quarterly meeting? A. On Thursday, December 10th. B. On Monday, December 7th. C. On Friday, December 11th. The correct answer is A. On Thursday, December 10th. Number 18. Dear travel enthusiasts, join us for an exciting webinar on Exploring Europe on a Budget next Wednesday at 7 p.m. Learn tips and tricks for making the most of your travel experience without breaking the bank. Visit our website to register and secure your spot. What is the topic of the webinar? A. 
luxury travel destinations. B. Exploring Europe on a budget. C. Business travel tips. The correct answer is B. Sustainable tourism.